on Farmer um, Delhi, just waiting for Emma Zidane to come onto the field to play, and then we'll get this match underway. Yoranga at three, and one of the great Hall of Famers, Ignacio Hege. So there it is, balls into play. The match is underway here, comes out the line out. First onto this is going to be Brané. Brané takes it on the near side, takes it out towards the side line there. You see some good strong marking there. So big neck shot by Brané, sends it up there for Rashid. Rashid been dry, deep down into the bottom corner there, unmarked at the moment, giving him a little bit of space and time to turn this ball. Being chased down there. In behind is Salvador takes it across his back line as he does. A very talented young player here, drives it in towards goal. What's he going to do with this one? And exactly, that's exactly what he does do with this goal. The flags are aloft. First goal there within the first 30 seconds here to Bindrai Polo. So once more, the two teams lining up here in the middle of the field. Changing ends. In it comes, out the front for Billy Healy. Billy backs that ball out towards Marinito Yaranga. Yaranga sells down at this time, drives that ball up, didn't quite get the next shot the angle he was looking for, and it looks like it's going to beat them out over the back line. So Brané to bring the ball in for Bindrai Polo in the white helmet. Bindrai in the black. Zidane in the white. Taps the ball one way, comes the other way, being marked hard there by Billy Healy, having to yield and just give way a little bit. This time he drives the ball. He's a huge hitter of the ball. This young man being known to hit the ball from the halfway line straight through the goal. On the far side there to his teammate Salvador Ujo. Ujo in the camouflage helmet, sets it alight here now, sends away up the field here. Being hard chased there, Barinito up he comes, big bump and a ride off there once more. Coming onto the play is Guillermo, but unfortunately, there's a whistle on the play. Billy Healy trying to clear the goal there. 530 on the clock and two goals in the lead already. Bin dry over Zidane. Rashid bin dry. So two teams lining up in the middle of the field. In the ball goes, stuck in the melee there. Look, looking for it hard. Brané comes out with this time, looking to get up past. His teammate leaves it on the near side for Ithaburu. Ithaburu comes up further forward. He's ridden hard off out of the play there. Over the top of it goes Billy Healy, the backhand for Ujoa. Ujoa sends that ball in, looking to link up with Rashid. But the first onto this one here is going to be Marianito sending the ball up beautifully for Amazadan. Amazadan sends that ball. It's ball sitting up sweetly for him there. Sends it up down the field, being hard chased there in the, in the Emirates helmet is Rashid sends that ball in towards goal, but unfortunately, cruelly, it goes wide to the left. So we'll have a hit in where the ball went out over the back line in favour of Bindrai Polo for JJ Brané. Brané takes a tap, causes Mark towards him in the form of Nacho Hagi. Drives it up forward, takes it up for Yushoa, turns him up on his own. Backhand comes in by Billy Healy, no, by Marianito as far as Ithaburu. Ithaburu plays, makes the play, turning the ball in front of the Zidane player. Sets a light himself now across the halfway line. Watching the ball closely there is Nashu Hagi. Sends the ball up for Marianito. Goes up past Marianito, comes inside for Bindrai. Bindrai takes a drive at goal. Goes a little bit wide out towards the right-hand side of the goalpost here. Working hard back onto this one. Ithaburu trying to get back onto the ball there before it goes out over the back line. But unfortunately, it just beats him out over the back line. So the score remains at two goals. Bindrai, zero. Zidane. Nachi Hagi brings the ball back into play. Marinito Yuranga up to Ujoa to keep him off out of the way, giving Nachi that little bit of luxury space and time. Having to yield out of it, Nachi takes the ball forward, further forward, comes the other way in towards the middle of the field, closing down the angle. This time he goes with the big driving shot, sends it up over the halfway line, looking to link up with his teammate in the form of Marianito. Marianito comes up onto the line of the ball here now. And as he does, we have a whistle on the play.
So the ball is placed down for a penalty in favour of... Brane goes with a big drive. It's long ago and gets cut out of the play there by Nachi Hege. Takes it on the near side, scoops it round, turns the ball round here this time, in behind Brane this time. Sets a light, reckon he's got the horse, goes up past him himself. Brane, Brane comes in, trying to, trying to play the hook. Settles down onto the play here, takes the ball on the near side here. Brane, Brane very cleverly, plays a big, strong neck shot and acute angle underneath the neck there for Marinito. Marinito plays a cutting, very awkward little neck shot backwards underneath the pony's nose, and it is now for Ujoa. Ujoa sets a light here. Ujoa drives the ball up there in front of Rashid. Rashid bin dry out there in front of goal, coming up onto the line of the ball. Can he get to this ball before he gets to the back line? He cuts a very acute shot, and he does. There's no missing from this young man. You wouldn't believe that he's been out of practice because he's been studying in London. Comes back in, drops straight back into polo like a duck out of water. So, the score now, three goals to zero. Bin dry over Zidane. As Zidane quickly leave the field of play to change ponies. But as we saw in the last match, teams can get a long way ahead and it's possible to close the gap and slowly, stoically work their way back into the game as Gantut did over Abu Dhabi. So the ball back into play once more. Ujoa picks it up this time at the back of the line out as they scramble back into play. Out of the way, out of the way goes, the, goes the umpire. Ujoa sends this ball up. Ricochets off the pony, leaving the ball now for Nachi. Nachi settles down on this black mare here. Settles down further forward, goes up. He realizes he's got Brady to get past. Shuts down the angle on it. Takes a driver goal, looking to link up with his teammate. And he does. Sets that ball up for Healy. He goes for the next shot, puts that ball down. It goes with that one. Where's that flag? What is going on? The flag's all off. There it is. First goal out here now for Zidane Polo. Taking the score now to three. Three goals to one. So a great goal there by Marianito Yuranga. Two teams lining up, changing ends once more. Ball bowled into play, stuck at the twos, out it comes in form of the Buru, but left out there on the near side for Rashid Mindrai, he gets hooked out of it. Coming up now it is Ithiburu once more, Ithiburu comes up, couldn't quite gather that ball. Yes, he still manages to gather that ball on the near side, reaching an awful long way back for it, settles it down onto it, turns the angle, closes the gap, but as he does, Nachi is sitting in there waiting behind, saying thank you very much indeed. And the whistle blows, so we'll have a penalty here now. Nachi Hege brings it in, up to his mark, Ujoa this time unloads it, sends that ball up over the halfway line, deep down into, into the territory of Pindrai. Called off the play there is Ithaburu. The next shot comes in by Brane to keep the ball moving around the field for Ithaburu to come onto. And it is Amazadan coming up onto the play here now. Ithaburu comes in, Ithaburu plays the next shot and we have a whistle on the play. And that'll end the first chuckle, ladies and gentlemen, with a score being three goals to one. Nachi takes the big one, drive shot straight in towards goal. Where's that? Watch the flags, ladies and gentlemen. There it is. He says it's lofted straight through. That's how you do it, ladies and gentlemen. A great goal there by Nachi Hagee, showing his wares. Taking the score now to two goals to three. Zidane, two goals. Bin dry, three. Nachi Hagee, of course, having won nearly all the major titles that Polo has to offer throughout the world and won the Argentine Open, the coveted Argentine Open a number of times, so the ball into play once more, coming out with it here is Nachi once more, Nachi goes away with the ball here, takes it out towards the sideline a little bit to take it away from Ujoa, takes a look up, takes a drive up towards goal, doesn't go quite as far as he'd like, like to, in comes the near side backhand of Brane, Brane's backhand as far as Rashid, Rashid comes onto the play, avoiding the hook there of Ithaburu, as he comes up, strong, strong play there by Rashid bin dry. you see Ithaburu keeping Nachi Hege out of the way, keeping the danger man out of the way, that's three goals, taking eight out of it, that's a five goal difference, giving the space and time and luxury for Rashid, Rashid Takes the big cut shot. Has he got it? Has he got it? It looks like it's going just a little bit wide from here. And unfortunately, it just goes wide to the right. Yeah. 
So once again, Nachi Hagi to bring the ball back into play for Zidane Polo, keeps it short. Cuts back in towards the middle of the field. This time goes with the driving shot, sends that ball up, looking to link up with... And there's a down now, he's looking to link up with Marianita Yaranga. Yaranga at full pace, just flicks that ball forward out underneath the nose of Brane. This time settles down, goes on the near side, looks to play the ball in towards the goal, and he does, and he puts it straight through the goal. There's a lovely bit of executed polo there by the Zidane Polo from the back line, driven up by Nachi, taken forward, not an easy task to do by Marianito, who's been hard chased by there by Brane, and puts the ball through the goal on the near side. So now we have it even, Stevens, three goals apiece. Ball back into play. In the melee, coming out with it on the near side here, trying to play the hook on Zidane. Amazadan Zidane gets away with it there, avoids the hook of Rashid. Amazadan Zidane once more plays a little backhand, cuts it into play. Marianito unable to pick that ball up at this point in time. Leaves it for Brane. Brane, a little cut shot, linking up with Yujoa. Yujoa on the ball, settles it down. Comes in behind Nachi, cuts it the other way, ho opens the shoulder, drives that ball up the field, looking to link up with Ithaburu, but the first onto this is going to be Rashid on the near side. Rashid bin dry, Rashid bin dry once more, comes up onto the near side play, plays it again, looking for something was. Marianito, in comes the backhand, but no, nothing, I was stopping this young man here. There's another goal, a great goal there by Rashid bin dry. Certainly playing off his, out of his socks here this afternoon. Played very well against Habtor. Sure, the handicappers will probably have a look at this young man as well. Playing with a lot of confidence out here on these marvellous fields here at Gantut Racing and Polo Club. So, once again, two teams back to the middle of the field with the score being four goals to Bindrai, three Zidane. Back into play. Ball out the back of the line out. Brane settles down on it. Turns the ball slightly to see where his markers and see where his teammates are. Taps the ball up a little bit further this time. Goes for the big driving shot. Tries to send that one in for the boys to try and put through the goal. And it's been cut out of play for Nachi. Nachi circles round on the ball here this time. Nachi Higgy takes the ball up this time. Drives it further up. Looking to link up on the side there. But first on back onto this one is going to be Rashid Bindry. Takes the ball on the bounce. Linking up with... Brane read that one well on this chestnut gelding here with a white face. He plays very strongly on indeed, trying to control this ball. Sticks on his side, hasn't shut it down a little bit here. Angles the ball in, sends it across the face of goal, but it looks like it's gone right across the face of goal and it's beaten them out over the back line. So Zidane once more to bring the ball back in from their own back line, Nachi Higgy. Classic diamond shape across the face of his own goal. Ujoa comes in, goes himself this time, because he's got the horse, got the acceleration, goes up pass, plays a little back shot to Marianito. Marianito this time plays a beautiful driving shot up to set up Nachi once more. Nachi being chased hard there and ridden off out of the play by Brane. Brane settling it down. Taps the ball forward back into his own space, turns around the corner here, not being chased hard on the line here. Nachi having to yield as he crosses in front of him. This time he turns, hits the ball up, looking to link up with his teammate. But the first one back onto this one looks like it's going to be Rashid bin dry. Rashid bin dry asks for a little bit more for the pony, being hard marked and watched there closely by Billy Healy. Near side, takes it out towards the boards here, takes it on the near side, near side again. Beautiful play, hooks out, pips off a horse foot. The backhand comes in by. Ithaburu looking to set up Brane. Brane looking for the next shot here in towards goal. Brane takes the shot at goal. Where is it? And oh no, it's just gone wide. So players quickly changing ponies here. Apollo Pony. I remind you once again, can play one, can play two chuckers in any one match. If it Keeps it short. Here's Marco Ujoa. Salvo Ujoa, waiting for him there. Goes past him this time. Taps the ball, gets a little bit of Ujoa on that one, but Nachi's away with it this time. Goes into open space. He's got Brane to get past. Brane looking over his shoulder, just waiting for it, yielding just a little bit, so he's got the play. Drives into there, the ride off, leaving it behind now for Marionito, Marionito Yaranga played the dynamics of this team when he came to join it halfway through the Silver Cup here now and it is driven up there by and the backhand for Nachi to try and keep it in play but unfortunately the drive of Marinita Yoranga was too strong and out over the back line it went
So the ball is placed down on the back line for JJ Brané for Bindrai to bring back into play. Brané keeps it short, taps it forward, taking the extra territory. Nachi comes in to challenge him on that one there. Nachi steals the ball from underneath his nose. The whistle is silent. Nachi has to stick a ball, this ball in, controls the pony. He does. The flags are aloft. There it is. Four goals apiece now for Zidane and Bindrai. JJ Brané think he had crossed the line in front of him. Umpire's whistle remaining silent. Nachi finishing it off. Taking the score to four goals apiece as the two teams line up once more. In the ball comes, out the back of the line, out it comes for Billy Healy. Billy Healy's away on this one here now. Being hard chased there by Rashid Lee. out a long way, trying to hook him, takes the ball up on the near side here, sends it in towards goal. And where's that flag? It looks like it's just gone wide to the left. Once more, Brané to bring the ball in for Bindrai from his own back line. Brings it wide out. There's the first bell. 30 seconds left to play. Dummy's the big shot. Has to go back for it. Natchez comes round, trying to get onto it. Umpire has to scurry out of the way quickly here to get out of the way. Takes the ball up the field here, trying to keep this ball in play rather than hitting the boards. Brané. Brané on a run here. Takes the big driving shot underneath a couple of ponies there, looking to set up. Rashi Bindrai. Rashi Bindrai gets tri driven across the field to play there. And as he does, we have a whistle on the play. And that'll end the second chucker here, ladies and gentlemen, with four goals apiece. So we'll just have a quick break now, 10 to 15 minutes for half time for a team chat. So Brané walks up to this one, drives it through. But it looks like it just went wide to the left. And we'll have a hit in from the back line for Zidane. This time it is Marinita Yaranga brings the ball open for Nachi. Nachi settling down on the play, being marked hard by Brané. Brané can't do much with that one. There's a beautiful lofted drive up the field there by Nachi Hagi. Gets a bit of backspin on that one there. Coming up onto the play is Billy Healy. Billy gets hooked out of that play there. Sorry, Marinito did. Onto it now is Brané to clear up. Healy comes in to try and spoil the, spoil the play on it there. Healy coming in. Brané taps the ball slightly further forward on this one. Brané, a big bump and a ride off there. Brané unsighted on that one there. Yuranga comes onto it, being followed there by Ithaburu. Plays a beautiful open backhand to try and set up Nachi. Nachi looking over his shoulder here. Comes onto the line of play on the near side play. Coming in towards goal. Nachi Hagi on the near side again. Taps that one through. There's going to be no mistake there, ladies and gentlemen. And there's the goal. There it is. Five goals to four for Zidane Polo over Bindrai. Once again, the two teams lining up, changing ends. Ball bowled into play, out the back of the line, out it comes, nice and clean for Brané. Brané turns circle, close, closes the angle down, sends Ithaburu up the field. He's been hard marked, is Brané by Nachi Hagi, drives that ball in for Ithaburu, but Ithaburu's kept off out of the play there for near side backhand by Billy Healy, but it ricochets off a pony and comes wide out towards the side. I've come onto this ball for the quick backhand. It is there Rashid Rashid over the top of that one there? Marinito comes onto the line of the play here. Billy Healy comes in, gets hooked high out of the play there, leaving it now for Nachi. Nachi scoops that ball out towards the balls, realizes he's got Yujoa coming to join the party here. Yujoa comes with a big strong hook there. Nachi having to regain, recover this ball here. Brané comes in once more. The big backhand comes in. Is it as far as Billy? Billy comes up onto this ball here, leaves that ball unable to make a play on it, having to yield Yujoa. Come onto the play here now, takes it underneath the neck here. Yujoa up onto the line of the ball this time. Marinito thought he could have a play on that ball, but the whistle is still silent here. It's now coming back onto it is. 
Bin Dry. Bin Dry goes with a big next shot in towards goal. Didn't quite get as much on it like, leaving it for Nachi Hege to open this backhand up in towards the middle of the field here, looking to link up with the player, but the first one onto this one is going to be Ujoa. Ujoa plays the backhand, gets a bit of a backhand on that one, linking up with Brane. Brane taps the ball, trying to control it here, taking it wide of the goal, trying to avoid the hook also of Nachi Hege. He does. Taps the ball around the corner here, avoiding the hook there. And Marinito playing some great skill work there. Is Brane. Brane looks up a goal, dribbles that ball in towards goal. And where is it? Has it gone through? Yes, it has gone through. Brane, cool, co cool, composed play there. Dribbles the ball round, avoids the hook, turns the ball round in towards goal. A very narrow angle and has to put the ball through three horses and still gets it through the goal. Five goals apiece. It's not just difficult enough to ride a horse. You've got to ride a horse and also control the ball. Knowing only too well you've got two other players trying to spoil your play. So we just have a slight pause in play whilst the ball is just cleared off from the centre of the field so there's no confusion before the ball is bowled in once more to get this third chucker underway with a score, five goals apiece. There it is, ball into play, out the back of the line it comes. Nachi on the near side takes it forward. Yujoa comes up onto the player to join the party, plays a clever little backhand there. Does Nachi come to the near side, comes Yujoa. Yujoa showing his wares, quickly got that pony around here, trying to set up. Brane, Brane coming away here now this time. Brane plays the next shot in towards goal. Comes off the back of Nachi's pony here, leaving it now for Ithaburu. Ithaburu collects the ball, taps it in forward, taps it in forward, past his marker there, and he comes up, goes up past the goal this time as it gets ricocheted off, plays the backhand in towards goal. Watch that flag, watch that flag, what's it doing? It stays down, it's gone wide. Ithaburu's initial shot was deflected from the goal by a defending player, had another bite at the cherry, but unfortunately it just went wide, so Marinito brings it in, sending Nachi on the run, sending him out towards the side there, being hard marked there by Brane, Brane yields to nobody, comes in, backs that ball, sends it back in, lucky to link up with Ujoa, Ujoa picks it up on the near side, now onto the stick side, lets the ball settle, goes over the top of that one, unfortunately, Marinito brings that ball forward at pace, leaves it, called off the play by Nachi, Nachi settles down, turns around, turns it up towards the centre of the field here, drives that ball up, and a good lofted drive up the field here, trying to get it up to Billy Healy, unfortunately, unable to control the ball as it just flicks off over. Controlling the ball this time is Brane. Brane up onto it, met there by Nachi Hagee, turned up the line. Nachi, Nachi's away here now, being chased there by Rashid. Nachi composed in towards goal, it comes here. Nachi coming up strong, collects the player, puts it on the near side, leaving it now for Amazadan Zidane as Amazadan Zidane puts that one through for Zidane Polo. Taking the score to six goals to five. He saw the cool, calm, collected play by Nachi Hagee. Realising he had a player coming in, if he had played the ball on his stick side, he would have been probably hooked out of it. So he rode the player off, played the ball on the near side, flicked it in towards goal, unmarked. Amazadan comes in and finishes it off, scoring the goal. Two teams line up, bowled in once more, out the back of the line, out it comes. Brane just unsighted slightly. Nachi gets a little bit of a play on the ball here. And it's cry of anguish, turning around on the play. There is Rashid, avoiding the hook there, playing incredibly well. This young man here takes the ball further forward, well avoiding the hook there of a stronger player, but he manages, this time he gets hooked out of it. Backed in, collected by, intercepted by Ujoa. Ujoa takes the ball up towards goal for Bin Dry. Bin Dry on the attack now, raising attack once more. Being hard chased by Nachi. Ujoa running hard. Is it going all the way? Is it going all the way? Or did it just go wide? It looks like it just went wide it's what it's all about keeping the pressure on so the score six goals to five Zidane over been dry for Nachi Hagee for Zidane Polo to bring the ball back into play Nachi Hagee Brings the ball in between the two marking players. He has Yusho. Yusho kept off out of the play there by Marinito. Brings it up further forward, realizing he's got to get past Brane this time. Unfortunately, we have a whistle on the play. Brane believing that she had enough room to come past. I'm poor. Nachi, a big driving shot, trying to get that one over the top. It looks like it's just gone wide to the left, though. So, 
We will have a hit in from the back line for Bindrai. Not wasting any time. Brané comes open with it. Goes with a big next shot. Trying to send this one up the field. Unfortunately, his teammates ridden off out of the play there by Marinito. Marinito plays the backhand only as far as Healy, but no, it is Ujoa. Ujoa first onto this ball here. Sets the Espanya light out here, keeps it short, avoiding the hook there, taking it further forward, waiting for the ball just to settle over the top of that one there. Unfortunately, can't do it. Called off, it has been dry, leaving it for Brané. Brané coming through at pace through the traffic, and there it is, ladies and gentlemen. On the hooto of the end of the third chucker, we have six goals apiece. Goes with a big driving shot, it's along the ground, cut out a little bit there by Ushua. First back onto this one, looks like it is going to be Ithaburu. Ithaburu stops the play there, and as he does, he's slightly across the line. We have an oncoming player in the form of Nito Yuranga. As Nachi Higi tees this one, tees this one up, been dry. Nachi drives it straight over the top. The flag's aloft. There it is. Seven goals to six. So down over Bin Dry. Once more, the two teams lining up, changing ends. Esteban Nero Ferrari bowls the ball in, cleanly out the back of the line out. The backhand comes in by Brane. Brane unsighted there slightly as it just ricochets off a pony, having to yield, leaving it for Nachi. Nachi this time goes with the driving shot, sends it up towards the goal here now, but the first one back onto this one looks like it's going to be Ujoa. A big bump and a ride off comes in, but Ujoa plays a nice little open backhand, gets back onto it himself. Very clever play, gets that pony around quickly, up and around with momentum. Ujoa's come a light here now. What are we going to do with this one? And comes in with a backhand over the top of it there. Well, there's a damn player leaving for Marinito playing the game. He's over the top of that one too, unfortunately. The backhand, a strong backhand by Nito Yaranga looking to set up Nachi. Nachi comes up onto the play, infringed and impaired in his right of way by Itaburu. A very clever play there by Nachi Hagi. And the result is a penalty in favor of Sudan. Nachi looking to get it all the way down to the 60, but the umpires are saying, no, come back, guys. Halfway. 30 yard line or within the 30 yards. Nachi, big driving shot up the field, up to about the 60-yard line there, trying to set up Amazdan. Amazdan onto the ball to play here. Backhand comes out there, beautiful backhand by Rashid. It looked like Nithaburu gets, jumps onto the line quickly here, being hard chased there. Drives a big neck shot, trying to link up with Yuzhoa. Yuzhoa controls this ball there in behind Nachi, realizes he's got the might of Hagi to get past. Comes up past, drives a beautiful lofted drive. Hagi looking to get onto this ball here quickly. You've got the likes of... Brané coming up hard up the line here. Brané comes up onto the line of the ball here. And Brané comes on with an opposition player as well. But unfortunately, the whistle blows for Brané. So we have a penalty for Zidane. Nachi taps it forward. Yuzhoa comes close this time. Goes wide, sends it out. In front of Joa for Marinito and Nito Yaranga. Nito Yaranga settles down the ball, being watched hard there by, Bra by Brane. Coming in behind once more is Hege. Hege taps the ball up this time. Yaranga being kept out of the play there by Brane. Sets up on the run here this time. Goes with a big driving shot, does. Nachi sets that one up there for Zidane, but it's backed out of the play there by Rashid taken on the near side but unable to keep it clean. But this time on the near side is going to be Marianito sends the backhand in towards goal for Brane. Brane, Brane, uncharacteristically over the top of that one there. Now turns round back onto the play and we have a melee. We have a bit of a tussle in there and we have a whistle on the play as Nachi comes hard down the line. So a ball is placed down for a penalty two inside the 30-yard line for Zidane Polo. Nachi Hagi tees it up. Bindrai having to retire back 30 yards.
Nachi taps it through. The flags are off. There it is. Extend their lead to eight goals to six. Sedan over Bindrai Polo. Esteban Ferrari waiting for the two teams to settle. Bowls the ball in, and it comes out of the back of the line. It comes Nachi. JJ just having to yield on that one there. Sends the ball up, looking to set up. Amma Sedan is there out in front of goal. Being hard chased there by Rashid Bindrai. What can Amma do with this one? Amma looking to place this one through. Amma's looking to place another one through. What does it What does the goal judge say? The goal judge is a little confused, but unfortunately, it looks like it's just gone wide. So, Brane to bring the ball in from his own back line. Looking to get down the other end of the field. So he gives it a good welly up the field here now. Sends the ball up there for Rashid on the near side. Nachi leaving the ball there. No, it isn't. It's actually Billy Healy there in behind him. You don't go, want to leave this young man because this man will punish you. And he does. So it is if the Burro on the near side sends it in towards goal.